Hi sewing friends, welcome to my sewing room. My name is Beth and if you're new, welcome. Today I'm putting together a little bag to hang on my godmother's walker. She is staying with us for now and this was a little something that we kind of needed as we um, move around the house to keep our essential items handy. So I'm using some decorator fabric here that I had in my stash and it's so pretty. This is a folded piece of that striped fabric and when it's folded it's nine inches tall and here's this beautiful bird fabric seven inches tall and both of these pieces are 14 inches wide. Such a simple project. I'm using some um, bias tape it's sometimes called. It's also called um, binding an old package of that that kind of matches the right color and my bird fabric needs to be adjusted to the right length but first after um, before I adjust the size of the length of that piece of fabric I'm going to put a little um, finish the edge on the top this is going to be the pocket of my bag finished my pocket and I've trimmed everything and I have three layers because I wanted that striped fabric to show on the front and the back. So I've got three layers of fabric and I'm going to pin the three together to keep them together. Put the pins kind of away from the edge and I'm going to be adding that green binding all the way around my bag. I left a little tail on that binding and I just opened up that one side and I, before getting to the end, I stopped and did a diagonal stitch to the corner so that I could do a nice fold here on the corner of the bag and I'm going to go all the way around just like this. When I got to the end, I folded over that first tail that I started with so that the raw edges will all be inside. And then I will sort of lay that last little bit over the top. And when I cut the end off and fold everything to the front, all of the raw edges will be inside. turned my little bag over to the front 
and just rolled that binding to the front and now I'm going to top stitch all the way around. I'm putting three little ties on the top, one on each end and one in the middle. And I just am sewing back and forth right there at the middle of my tie on the back of the bag, right next to that binding. And before you know it, I'm going to have a bag for that walker for my godmother. The last thing I did was I separated some pockets in this large pocket. All I had to do was sew two seams. I decided on three pockets. I did a little back stitch at the top and just sewed a straight line all the way down. And I did the same thing um, on the left side. This is a handy little pocket that I'm adding to a walker and it's just fun to know that when you know how to sew you can make almost anything you need if you have a little bit of fabric. Thanks for joining me today and I'll see you next time.